effect of the color of visible light on the rate of photosynthesis in Hydrilla fertilizer. Problem formulation. Does the color of visible light affect the rate of photosynthesis in Hydrilla? What color of visible light affect the most on the rate of photosynthesis in Hydrilla? Objectives To know that the color of visible light affects the rate of photosynthesis in Hydrilla. To know which color of visible light affects the most on rate of photosynthesis in Hydrilla. Hypothesis Certain colors of visible light affect the rate of photosynthesis, especially the blue light, which gives the most rate of photosynthesis in Hydrilla. Tools We need funnels, test tubes, containers, color lamps, light circuit set. In materials, we need Hydrilla fertilizer and water. Method First of all, fill the container with water. After that, prepare the plant. Take funnel and put the hydrilla in the funnel. Then, enter the funnel and the hydrilla into container with inverted. Next, fill the test tube with water. Enter the tip of the funnel into the test tube. Make sure there is no air space or bubble in the tip of the test tube. And then, make these things until we got four containers. After that, give label to each container A, B, C, and D. Place the container A in white room. Then, container B in blue room. Then, container C in red room and the last container container D in green room turn on the light after we put the container to each light room after three hours Look at the tip of each test tube and compare the airspace or bubble that has formed. Experimental Results and Discussion After 3 hours of observing, we look at the tip of each test tube. Test tube A in white room as control has a lot of air space. Test tube B in the blue room has much more air space than test tube A. 
test tube C in red room has a lot of air space but not much than the test tube B. And the test tube D in green room has a few of air space. Photosynthesis is the process by which plants use light, water, and carbon dioxide to create energy and oxygen. As we can see from this experiment, taste tube B in blue room and taste tube C in red room have a lot of air space than taste tube D in green room. That means plants do respond differently to different colors of light being shown on them because chlorophyll reflects green light and absorbs blue and red. Therefore, blue and red are useful for photosynthesis, but green isn't. Conclusions From the experiment, we can conclude that color of visible light affects the rate of photosynthesis in plants, especially the blue and red light which gives the most rate of photosynthesis in plants.